Hey, it's Miss Lalana, and we are working on today's math practice. It is Tuesday, April the 12th, and this is number four, numero cuatro. All right, so the domain for this problem is number and operations in base 10. I'm going to read the standard. You can read it with me. It's number six. It says add up to four two-digit numbers using strategies based on place value and properties of operations. Okay, so... Ooh, look at these numbers. What do we have to do? Add and show your work, okay? I better not see you just write an answer right there, okay? Don't just write an answer there because can you add that way? Oh, no. What do we have to do with the numbers? Write them vertically. We need to write them up and down. You can't just add that way. You can try, but... You're going to get confused, then your answer might be wrong, and ah, then you're going to have to start over. So we're going to write them straight up and down. Now remember, two different ways you can do that. You can write all the numbers all together and add them all, or you can do two by two. So you can add that, and then add that, and then add that, all right? So raise your hand if you're going to do the first strategy I said by writing all all the numbers together in a row together like that all right now raise your hand if you are going to do two by two two and then add that and then add that all right guess what you can do either way as long as you add correctly uh, and if you do that your answer is going to be right so whichever way works best for you to make it easier for you and that helps you get the answer right do that way okay so the first way, I'll do both ways. The first way, I'll write them all up and down. I'm going to write it on the side. 32 plus, tw ah, I messed up already. 28, 24, 11. All right. I messed up that too a little bit. All right, so I have 32 plus 28 plus 24 plus 11. Now remember, you don't have to write plus, plus, plus. You could just put the plus at the bottom right there. All right, so what do we add first? The ones, place. All right, so we have 2 plus 8, which is what? That is 10. And then 4 more is 14 plus 1 is 15. So I'm going to write that, write the 5 and put the 1 over the tens, place. Just like that. And then let's do 1 plus 3 is what? 4 plus 2 is 6. Plus two, six, eight, and then one is nine. Right, let me see if I did that right. Okay, all right, so look at that again. All right, one plus three is four, plus two is six, plus two is eight, plus one is nine. So the answer is 95. All right, so you can do it that way, or we can do two by two. All right, so I'm going to do 32. And do that first. 32 plus 28. All right, so what's 2 plus 8? 2 plus 8 is 10, right? The 0, carry the 1. And then I have 1 plus 3. What's 1 plus 3? 4. And then 2 more is 6. You see that? That's 6. So that's 60. Am I done? Oh, no. we got to add the rest. So now I have 60 plus what? 24. Oh, I think someone, someone's at the door. Let me go get the door real quick. All right, that was Kayla. She just came from school. Not little Kayla, my big Kayla from Tucker High School. All right, so let's see. So I have 60 plus 24. See, I just did it right there. All right, so zero plus four is four, and then six plus two is eight. So now I have 84. Are we done? Oh, no. There's one more number plus 11. So write 84 plus 11. All right, let's add that. What's 1 plus 4 is 5, and then 8 plus 1 is 9. Bam, right there, 95. Oh, look, same answer. 
See, I told you, no matter what you do, you get the same answer as long as you add it right. So you could do it this way or that way. All right, and then actually you could do both ways if you want to, to show that you're so smart that you could do it any kind of way that you need to. So when you're done with that, make sure you explain and write down what you did to solve that problem and then give yourself a double thumbs up, woo, 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 and then go ahead and do the next question uh, and get all your work done for the day.